I'm Doug Burleson, the director of the Freed Hardeman University Lectureship, and maybe you've already seen the schedule for the 2020 program or gone online and looked at all the things that are available. Wanted to tell you today about something we're really excited about that's just been added to the program. Uh, we're partnering with the Christian Chronicle to have a panel discussion on Wednesday afternoon, February the 5th, after the Open Forum on the stage of Lloyd Auditorium. We're going to think about how congregations should respond to shootings. Tragically, that's been on our minds a lot recently, and we've invited, along with Bobby Ross Jr., the editor-in-chief of the Christian Chronicle, three participants in that panel discussion, including our own director of security here at Freed Hardeman, Stuart Bracken, who has a lot of experience with law enforcement, and two men who are preachers in congregations that have experienced, tragically, these kinds of events, including Brett Farmer from the West Freeway Congregation in Texas and Joey Spann from the Burnett Chapel Congregation in Antioch, Tennessee. And so again, this is going to be a time we're just going to talk about their experiences, but also how we are prepared for these kinds of things, how we respond uh, to these kinds of tragedies, how do we continue to reach out and seek to serve others, even in the context where these kinds of risks are very real. Uh, we're excited about it. And I know that's been a concern, I mean, just on a, this past week at the dinner table and even at church, I've been talking with members about you know, concerns about this, how are we going to approach what we do benevolence wise, how are we going to do this because people are starting to get scared of these events and it's good to be encouraged and have people like that. Yeah, I think a lot of us are thinking about this. We're looking forward to thinking about it in a more organized fashion. I think it's a blessing too that we get to gain some insight from people that have actually witnessed some of those tragic incidents. And while it's unfortunate, I think it's, it is a blessing that they're able to deliver some of that information to us because we might very well have to encounter one of those things one day. And it, just like with any serious incident, you're gonna default to your training. And I think that's why some of those words of advice will be very beneficial to mm -hmm. our audience. Sadly, it's something we all have to think about, isn't it? Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Well, we're very much looking forward to this. We appreciate the Christian Chronicle uh, reaching out to us as an effort to partner in a very relevant and real conversation. And again, we're looking forward to the whole lectureship and hope that you'll plan to participate in this, particularly in this uh, live panel discussion.